Today, I find some interesting wood. That looks interesting. Search for some goodies. Where did that go? Here it is. And have some fun with a creeper. This is fun. Yo dudes and dudettes, we got some crazy fun stuff planned for today. We are in all the mods, eight guys. We are in 1.19.2 modded Minecraft, which is fantastic. I've done a little bit of exploring already. We ran through a, a couple villages here um, and they had quite a lot of good loot. I have even found some boots and some compressed iron pants, uh, full armor. We got all the iron tools so we can get right into kind of more of the modded stuff that you guys are looking for. Check that, check that out. We have three diamonds and we even have a spawner agitator. Um, yeah, that make, basically makes the spawner go infinitely. We don't have to worry about it, which is super cool. But guys, we're gonna be building a house here. Um, and I wanted to use some good wood, uh, but we don't really have any good wood. I mean, we have oak wood, we got birch wood. Uh, but yes, I would like to try to use this wood snake. Hello, snake. How are you? What happens if you kill snake? Oh, he bites you. We got inferium. We got inferium and some some holes in us because the snake bit us. That's okay. That's a waystone way up there. You see that? That's cool. That's an orb. An orby. What is that even from? Let me know down in the comments if you know what that gray orb is from. Um, but yes, we do have the cool miner of the vein or Ultimine. And so if we take a look here, if we strip this, I think that looks pretty cool. I've never used this before in a build. Uh, so I want to go ahead and try it out. I think that'd be pretty cool. Anywho, we've also got this darker tree over here. We're going to go take a look at that. Uh, but we're going to see if we can get some sap. I think this is a rubber tree. Yeah, we will need the rubber trees rubber what are you white puff puff white puff ball spores okay this is a rubber wood log oh okay okay so do we get any rubber wood saps yes beautiful all right so we can start up a tree farm which will be pretty lit how does the rubber wood even look when it's stripped whoops you can't strip it okay that is okay but I actually think that it might look pretty good paired up. Yeah, that doesn't look half bad. Maybe we'll get some more rubber wood and some some things. That could be very fun. Okay, let's go mine this guy. I believe this is from all the modium. Pretty simple here. Ooh, we got a cave, or maybe a cave. Okay, so yeah, we have, oh, this is Ars Nivioa. There it goes, a little bit of lag, that's okay. And this is a single player world. Uh, this isn't on our modded server. Um, we might end up switching over this to the server. Don't quite know yet. Uh, we'll see what all of the members say. But yeah, we're just trying out all the mods eight on a single player world because we just started uh, all the mods seven to the sky. So we're going to keep that for a bit. Unless everyone's like, let's switch to all the mods eight, then we'll do it, you know. Cool. Cool. We're collecting very good wood. Very good wood. Cool. So we have this green tree over here. Ooh, we even got some more trees. There we go. Flourishing archwood, very cool. We got a village over here, but what is it? Maple. Ooh. Oh, we're out. Wait, can we? 
Okay, maple planks. That looks interesting. I don't know how I like that or not. I might love it. Oh, we got some dark oak. These are some weird trees. So, dark oak log. Pretty cool. Sorry, maybe maybe I don't do this with you guys on camera. This is kind of boring. <laughs> Let me go back and we'll get on to the, maybe the building or maybe after we have the initial floor plan going. Uh, yeah, I'll be right back with you. It's uh, pretty cool over here. We've got quite a few builds. There's the mine colonies thing there. Uh, we have this guy, we have this guy. This might be a screenshot I use for the let's, uh, the first episode here. Might be cool. Uh, don't quite know. We are getting quite full on things. We do have set home in the mod pack, which is nice. So we can just teleport back here. Uh, and this is our humble home. Yes. This is very cozy and open. Alright guys, so I've decided we're going to move the base into this kind of hill over here. It'll give us a lot more flexibility and expanding. Uh, and then over here we can kind of like put some things we want to put outside. I, th I just think it'll be a lot better. But we have a wandering trader in here. And he has something really cool. Uh, he's got this rainbow eucalyptus sapling. Um, and so we're going to buy one of these from him. And we're also going to buy those. So those are our emeralds and now we can kill them. There we go. Then we got some of those. Very cool. But yeah, we have this sampling here in a sense. Uh, hold left shift to view sampling patterns. So you need to do one, or we could do one, three, one. Okay. So maybe we can just put it here. Like, uh, otherwise, like, we really couldn't do anything because. He, we only had uh, seven emeralds and he would have required a little bit, a bit more if we needed to have a total of five. We would have needed, you know, 25, but that's okay. Uh, but I'm gonna keep going here, clear this out and we'll start making it feel a bit cozy in here. Maybe like a hobbit hole or something like that. That'd be cool. Ah, yes, very cozy. We are in our new home. We have uh, mineral doors, which are, whoa, I didn't know. <laughs> This grew. This is a little crazy looking. Uh, let's mine it. Very good. We got more saplings. Wow. Okay. That was pretty crazy. Okay. So it said to one by three, one, three, one. We're going to try that out now. So one. Okay. So like this. So let's let that work on growing itself. That was cool. Let's see how that wood looks. Um, interesting. Can you make a door out of it? It'd be really cool. You could make a door out of it. Oh, you can. Yeah, we're gonna put that here. Okay. That is sick looking. It's not really a rainbow, it's just like green and blue. Or maybe a little that. But like, I like the look of that. It looks cool. Yeah, it's really just green and blue, but. Hmm. Very cool. Kind of looks like you'd put this in like a paint area if you wanted to make like like a painter's like workshop area thing. But yeah, this is gonna be our home. We're gonna expand back into here. Uh, this reminds me a lot of my uh, Valhelsia 3 series base, starting off like that. Oh. Uh, but yeah, I wanna talk to you about all the mods, Seven to the Sky. Uh, don't worry guys, that will still be coming out. We'll just be putting out one video a week on that and two videos a week on all the mods. Eight, we'll definitely still be making content on there, so please don't worry. Um, and then you might be wondering, why did we start this? Well, because I need variety in my life. Don't get me wrong, I love all the mods to the seventh of the sky, but I love being able to be here. Um, you know, being able to like explore around, check out that building, check out the one that we have over here. Like, I, I just love being able to build whatever I want. So yeah, that's a big thing. And then also we have immersive engineering in here, which is very cool. Um, 
I'm a big fan of this. And anyway, we need to kind of start getting towards this. So we're making our way over here. So we need to make a Coke oven. Um, not for cocaine, seriously. Peoples, none of that. Uh, we don't like that stuff here. Uh, but for making Coke, uh, charcoal, and uh, we make a Coke oven. That's what we need. So we need to build this. So we need some clay, bricks, and some sandstone. So that's what we are going to be making here. And we have some utter... Oh, I almost said underwater. Underwater facilities. It'd be cool if we made kind of like a little kingdom out here and we could use this water to kind of shape some of it. It'd be pretty cool. You know, have like a little pond with some fishies in there. Yeah, it's really getting out of the hobbit hole kind of style, but you know, hey, it's Minecraft. We can do whatever the frick we want. Okay. Cool, cool. Let's go ahead and do some shoveling. Every day I'm shoveling. Oh, wow. That looks cool. That is cool looking. Jeez Louise. That wood is something else. I don't know if I love it, like 100%, but it definitely looks cool. Can you strip it? Okay. Man, that is very unique. It's probably one of the most unique wood types I've ever seen. Oh my gosh. I, I don't know why, but when I had the torch here with the sunflower, it just looked like something was coming after me. Anywho. Whoa. Kind of looks like a cat. Eye, eye, whiskers, whiskers. Nose. It looks like a cat. That's pretty cool. It's the cat door. Anyway, so we should have enough here to suffice, but we need, here we go, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I counted faster than I could click. Cool. So we have a fern eye, which is good. We didn't have one of these before. And we need, yeah, we can just melt up a full stack here. We got some coal. Booyah. So we'll get those rocking and rolling, and then I believe it's three by three by three, which is 27 bricks. Um, so yeah, three times nine is 27. So we need nine of these, so we need nine sandstone, and then nine times three, we need 36 bricks and 36 clay. Guys, math is fun. It'd be really embarrassing, though, if I got that wrong, and you guys all witnessed it. Anywho, so we'll let this melt up and I'll be back in a sec. Okay, so we should have everything we need to make the coke oven now, which is awesome. <clears throat> so let's see here. Yep, there we go. Okay, and so we just need to kind of put this into a wall. I was worried that might poke out, but we're good. And then we are going to need... Boy, that was weird. See that? Weird. Okay. Sorry. For a second there, it looked like some x-ray shenanigans going on. Okay. So, here we go. Perfect. Okay. Now we need the engineer's hammer, which is right here. It's going to require one string. Do we even have any string? Oh, no. We have no string. Monsters! Are you alive? Have you despawned, monsters? Oh, this guy's alive. That's not fun. You're exactly who I was looking for. Perfect! He even gave us a string. What a cool guy. All right, so now we should have everything we need. Uh, one iron. Perfect. Oh, sorry. Two iron. I feel silly. One string is what I meant. Beautiful. Now we have the hammer. We click it, boom. Now we have concentrated carbon and we can throw coal into here. It makes coal coke. And this gives us creosote oil, which allows us to turn normal wood into treated wood. Yeah, so a bucket of creosote oil and then we just surround it with wood and we get treated wood. <clears throat> and this allows us to do quite a few things, um, including one of my favorite garden cloches people say they don't like them but you know garden cloches are lit you know you, you just gotta love them uh and then make some water wheels get some power generating uh we can throw these right outside and utilize our waterfall here which would be really cool um so that this waterfall maybe we make a pool here or something like that in the next couple episodes put some fishes in there 
But yeah, it would just, it'll look really natural and really cool. And we can also get a windmill going. Oh man, the possibilities are endless. Okay, so we have a total of three buckets in here now, which is really good. Uh, so we're gonna convert this into those. We're only gonna utilize three of the iron we have. And we'll just pull them out one at a time. No problemo. And just do one of those. Bam, we got creosote oil. So then we surround it with wood. We get the treated wood. Perfect, 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 perfect. Now I do think the first thing we should try to make is a water wheel to start getting some power uh, generation going. So that's what we're gonna do. Now I do have some normal saplings here. We can, oh. Hi, bye doggo. Oh, there's a second doggo. He's a dead doggo, okay. Cool. So we can kind of start a tree farm. Mini melons, very cool. And we got some sweet potatoes. Very nice. Okay, so we'll just play, place the trees here. We can kind of place them a little bit away from each other so that the saplings, or that the, the leaves don't really mix a whole lot. That way we can hopefully get some more uh, saplings because there'll be more leaves. But yeah, there we go. We might leave that guy here for a little bit. He's kind of cool. Cool. All right. So now that we have that going, we can do that to a couple more pieces of things. Oh, wait, hang on a second. I think the rubber wood. Can we turn the rubber wood into charcoal? Where did I even put the rubber wood? Did I turn it all into rubber wood sapling? Let's try the rainbow wood. Can we do this? We can, perfect. So that actually should smelt a little bit faster too, which is nice. Um, yeah, so water wheel. Okay, so we're gonna need a couple of these guys. All right, so we did four of those. That means we have eight. All right, so we can do two. Cool, and then, yes, yeah, so we just need four and we need Deal. Oh boy. Um, blast furnace is what we need. And I believe with this one, yeah, we need magma blocks. We need to go to the nether first. Darn, unless there's another way to make steel in the pack. Um, there normally is, okay. So steel dust. Okay, so we can make an ore hammer. Um, just get iron dust. Okay. 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 Yeah, we can do that. So we need to get some, we need to go mining for a little bit. I need to get some copper and some iron. Uh, now copper is typically everywhere in Minecraft. If you guys haven't noticed, um, I'm really just exploring by the suit of my pants. All right. We already got copper, which is great. Beautiful. Oh, we even got iron. Raw iron. Okay. So, how do how do we already have a stack of over a stack of what? Okay, we're gonna keep those hemp seeds. We don't need that. Let's grab this guy. Can we not? Cool. So I should, oh, I forgot to do set home in our new base. That's okay. We will run. We like running here. Okay, so now we have some things to smelt. Um, so we can put this in here. Let's get some of these guys smelting. Let's, whoa. Let's get some more ferni going. We'll take some of you. Hang on a second. Okay, you there. This smelts 16 items. That's really sick. Okay. You go there. Do we have any copper or coal? I don't think we have any coal left, which is okay. So I'll go get some. Oh my goodness. Look at the size of this hole. <laughs> There's a Michael Scott joke to be made there. Okay. Uh, we need to find a safer route down. Now we do have some water over here, so that's our safe route. Is it? And I'm glad we brought the bucket too. Ow. What a great cave to find right off the bat. Got dimensional shards. What are you? You're all by yourself. A block of raw zinc. 
Okay. Just chilling by itself? That's interesting. Got Osmium Slate Ore. Do we even have Redstone yet? I believe we should be close. Oh, we got Deep Slate Iron. What are you? Slate Ore. Oh, tin. I didn't read that. Oh, Slate Ore. I feel dumb. I feel dumb. R forget that I even said that, please. What are you? You look neat. Aluminum. Very cool. Very cool. Okay, we came here just for coal. We're down below the coal level. Which is okay for now. That looks interesting. Okay, so... Well, I guess sandstone's gonna work. Right. Don't want that one there. Cool. So here's our little bridge. Let's check out what this one was. It's kind of shiny. Zychromium. I think that's how you say it. Probably not. I don't say things right normally. Okay. Uh, we don't need sweet potato. Oh, wait. Let's keep the sweet potato seeds. We'll get rid of the sweet potato. Get some more coal while we're here. I like this cave. This is a good cave. Holy cow, this is a good cave. What are you? Kivy. I'm going to take some of you. And what do we not need? We don't need dirt. Get out of here, dirt. Cool. We will definitely be going back to that cave a lot. I got a feeling it's going to be good. I think uh, there, there's a couple of different routes we can take with, like, um, like resource generating in this world. We can have, you know, like a big quarry going, and I don't know if that's good for lag. Um, we can have the bees. You know, we've done the bees before. We, done, we did the bees quite a bit. Uh, and I think that we haven't done... Um, like mystical agriculture in a while. So I think we might go that way. Like, I know we've done it a couple of times. Like, like we've done it for like a couple things, but like we really haven't like gotten like super into it. You know what I mean? Okay, so now... Now we can do this. I believe that will turn it into dust. Okay, so like this, and this gives us steel. It's like punching steel. Okay, and can we do this? No, we can't. If we can do that, though, I think that should smelt up fine. 1.5 items, yeah. It's half an item, so you have two sticks per. That's pretty neat. That I'm, I like that it tells you that, too. Cool, so we have the steel that we need. Oof. Chests. Am I right? Okay, so this should... Yes, look at that. We have several buckets now, which is amazing. Drain and buckets. Okay. That gives us another eight, which should mean we should have... Yes, the required amount. And this gives us a water wheel. Cool. Now we need something to be on the edge of it and get the energy from rotating. So what item was that again? Give me just a minute. Okay, I'm pretty sure it's this kinetic dynamo here. Ether set. Uh -huh. Hmm. Ocean ancient city map. What? 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 What is going on? That is weird. Anywho, we need to go back down into that big hole and get some redstone, and then we should be able to get it working. Um. Let's see here. This guy, copper coil. All right, so we need some scissors. That is okay. Um, shebang. Boom, boom, boom. Very good. Grab some of you. It's not... Oh, do I need to make it into a plate first? Is that what's going on? Is that what's going on? We need to make it into a plate? Yeah. Okay, so with the engineer's hammer, it's one for one. I know it's not very efficient, but, you know, hey, we'll do it. Okay, so that gives us seven, so we need one more. 
Oh, one more copper. Good. How are they taking damage? Who said you could take damage? Cool. So we have the... Wait, do we need eight of these? Yes, we do. Perfect. All right, so that gives us the low voltage wire. And then if we do this, we just need one iron. So here we go. Bam, copper coil. So we need two iron. We have the two iron. And then what else do we need? We need this guy, which is for more iron. Okay, so we definitely need to go back into that cave and do a little bit of mining. But cool thing is it's pretty close. Okay, so we have nine iron now. I think we need to cut. I think we need to come down into here. Okay, we got a zombie. Kind of getting into the depths of the. This goes down even further. What the heck? Gotta get me some of that. There's goodies. Oh, we got redstone. Where did that go? Here it is. Got some glow squid ink. Okay, scary lava. Okay, here we go. Got the iron, or sorry, the redstone. I believe that's everything that we need so far, which is awesome. Cool. Alrighty, so now that we have all of the required materials, uh, we actually need to smelt up a little bit. And can we use charcoal in the coke oven again? No, I believe it's just a one-time thing. So it should be a bit quicker than the actual like uh, coal itself going in. And I think it gives half, if I'm not mistaken. Something like that. Cool. So here we go. Oh, wow. This is way more cost-effective if we do it like this. Perfect. Okay. And then one of the... Well, it's way more cost-effective if we get the engineer's workbench in, but we don't quite have that yet, which is okay. Perfect. So that should mean, bam, we have the kinetic dynamo right here and ready to go. Oh, one more thing. Wait, is my field of view? Yeah, it's good. Um, I've noticed that my mouse is kind of glitching out on me. I thought it was like frame rate issues for a while. Um, but I have the Logitech G602 and I've tried updating the drivers and I honestly think that the mouse is just kind of on its last leg. Um, so if you guys have any ideas for like a, a good wireless mouse that maybe you guys use or something along the lines, like I'm probably going to be upgrading here in the next couple of weeks. Um, I do have a, an older wired one that I'm probably going to use temporarily. Uh, but yeah, I definitely need to kind of upgrade. So if you guys have any suggestions for mice, um, please let me know down in the, the comments. I'd love to see what mouse... Uh, you suggest um, and see if we can, you know, maybe use that one. It'd be cool. So uh, if we do this. Hmm. Okay, let's, let's, let's see here. Hmm. Okay, so maybe we need to kind of block this off for a second. Um. go like this that gives us some time or just the the ability to place it I know that now I've done this it's gonna flow a little differently which is okay but hmm I don't know maybe we'll, we'll let's just see how it looks okay it's not quite flowing the right way That is not what I wanted to happen. Jeez. Okay, so this is, oh my, hmm, hmm, maybe we'll need to see how to fix that, make it not look so terrible.
Okay. So yeah, that looks pretty bad, but it is working. So that's all that counts, right? Okay, so that is spinning. Um, so that means we should only need to get some cables going. Uh, so we take these, we flatten them, we pinch them, and then, I believe, yeah, low voltage. Ooh, we made one more than we should have. That's okay. Okay, so then we need these guys. Where are you? It's a relay. Uh, this dude. So, I'm going to smelt up a little bit more copper. Should have some more. We do. Okay. So, that's smelting up some stuffs. We need... I think it's four of these. Yeah. Okay. So, we're going to smelt these dudes up. Probably shouldn't have used the coal coke for that. Ah, oh, man. <laughs> That's okay. Cool. All right, items have been created here. Low voltage boy, here we go. Should we make a battery to start storing this power? Um, bucket of redstone acid. Well, an accumulator. I thought there were batteries in this. Were there not? A restored power. Just the accumulator. Well, I mean, that's not too difficult to make. Um, do we have any lead yet, though? I'll go get some lead. I'll be right back. So I got some lead, but it's a blood moon. Um, which is kind of scary. We're gonna do the set home command here now. Yeah, those guys almost got me. <laughs> There's quite a few of them out there, but we're okay in here. Uh, we're just, we're just gonna, I don't care. I don't care, we'll be okay. <laughs> yeah. Oh man, okay, so let's make this battery. Um, so we need a bucket of water. Oh, we need a bucket of water. Oh. Wasn't that something? I need to go out there. And there's a creeper out there. Why are they doing this to me? This is fun. We did it! Oh my gosh. That was terrifying, but we got it. We did it. <laughs> got the water bucket. So we can make the bucket of redstone acid here. Um, let's put this guy. That was a weird noise. Oh no, we need nickel. <clears throat> Wait, no, we just need the lead. What am I doing? We have. I got the thing that we needed. There we go, lead. Smelt up. This is crazy. Okay. So we have the lead here now. Um, okay, so we got the lead plates. We need the low voltage, not the high voltage. Okay, so we just need two more treated wood. Ah, we need to make another bucket. That's okay. Okay. Perfect. 
Perfect, all right, and then low voltage, accumulator, booyah. Perfect, now, so we just gotta wait till daytime and we will be set. Can I sleep? No, it's, it's a blood moon. Okay, we'll be back later. Okay, so the blood moon is finally set, but we do have a lot of mobs still out here. So what I think we should do is run away. And we get some bones too, so we can start bone mealing things. All right, cool. I have not been here before. The good place. Interesting. Barrels in a barrel. Ooh, an emerald. Okay, we'll come back for this. Ooh, we got bookshelf. Ooh. Oh, we got diamonds. And an iron pickaxe and some more food. Hmm. We don't need cobble. Cool. So that should mean everything's kind of despawned from our place. Yes, okay. So now we should be safe to do this. Oh, that's not what I wanted. That is not what I wanted. Problems. Problems. Did <laughs> you? Okay, so now we should be okay. Um, place this here. All right, and say if we want the battery here, right? What do we need to clear out for these guys? Where's the wire? There it is. So we click here. Oh, we got it. Perfect. So we are creating power. We're generating power. First episode. Let's freaking go. Ladies and gentlemen, that's going to wrap up the episode for today. If you enjoyed the video, please make sure to hit this like button. And as always, guys, don't forget to subscribe. But this has been Super Turtle. And today, we created some power. And we're even storing it with immersive engineering. Stay tuned for more episodes. It's going to be lit. See ya. Bye.